Welcome back to KSLA News 12. The coverage of the Great American Eclipse continues in Ida Bell, Oklahoma. I'm Bisky Duncan. And I'm Chris Diversion here for KSLA News 12. Of course, uh, Bisky, we were mentioning it all morning long. The scene, the atmosphere, this is incredible. This is history right before our very eyes. We are so lucky to be here today. This is something that everybody wants to experience, and we get to experience it in Ida Bell, Oklahoma. And we are so happy to be here yeah. thanks to the wonderful invitation of our mayor. Thank you. Thank you all for coming. We really appreciate it. We have had a blast being out here, and we've got to tell you, you are the man of the hour. Everybody wants to stop and talk to you as they go by, and that's what you want. I guess. Um, <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, we're just a good, friendly city. Everyone, like I say, everyone know everyone here. So, you know, we're just hard for that city here. Kind of piggybacking off Bisky's question a little bit. Um, obviously, having a chance to meet new people and meet people who, of course, had never heard of Ida Bell, maybe, maybe never heard of Oklahoma, perhaps. But meeting new people today, what's been the most interesting about meeting all these new people this weekend here in Ida Bell? Oh, man, everyone here seems like they're so friendly. Everyone is here for one thing, and that's the CD Eclipse, and we just hope the sun shine and it be good for us. It is. The sun is starting to peak out right now. We're hoping that the clouds are going to part. It's going to be something that is truly magical. You know, we've always heard that everybody gets really caught up in the emotions of the eclipse. Mm -hmm. You know, we were talking to some kids yesterday yes. that I think once they see it actually happen, they're going to go, wow, yes. what did we just witness? Yes. I mean, it's, I mean, it's history. It's, and when it's right here at our front door, you know. It you know, that being said, you mentioned the emotions behind it. What what makes it, I, I don't think I've ever seen an eclipse before in person myself, but what makes an eclipse so emotional? I guess from that aspect. I think it's just the change of the, going to daylight to dark in the middle of the middle of the day yeah. is, is special. I think so too. I think it's something that's just unusual and it's overwhelming. You know, you realize that you have a chance to witness some unique history, like you said. And I'm really looking forward to when the moon moves in front of the sun, we're going to have that perfect shot of totality. Everything's going to get quiet. We might hear some crickets chirping. That's what they've been telling us. We're going to see. We might hear some folks cheering. Everybody is really excited and really looking forward to it. You know, of course, we do have our eclipse cam up that we've been keeping up all morning so you can have a chance to look at the skies. All eyes are on the skies today. You know, mm -hmm. Ida Bell, of course, is a star of the show, but it's all about Mother Nature as well. That's right. I mean, we just, we're just hoping that the weather turn out good for us. I think we, we're here. That's it. We showed up. We, we did our part. Yeah, that's right. We're going to have a great time no matter what. I've loved seeing all of the families that have been setting up. You know, there have been picnics. There are folks grilling out there. There's some good food trucks. And I know that you actually had with the uh, festival this weekend, you had some folks that said, well, we're probably just going to stay for maybe one day and then head on out. You told me they were so busy. They had such a good time. They had to stay for the entire festival. That's right. Wow. And, we, and we're very happy that they stayed. I mean, I think we're going to need everything right now. I mean, the, the numbers are, we see folks showing up, and so I think we need it. I'm glad they're here. Yeah, Basically. absolutely. Are, are you surprised? I mean, of course, we all knew this was going to bring you know, anyone and everyone from all over the, all parts of the world, but are you surprised as how many people actually have been showing up today? I am really surprised. I mean, you know, you hear numbers, and you, you hear folks saying the numbers going to be big, but when you're walking around and, and you're and you conversating and folks are from, the northeast part of the country, even from other countries, you know, I am surprised. Mm. Do you ever think that you would see anything like this in Ida Bell, Oklahoma? No, not at all. I mean, this is so big for Ida Bell. There, there's a, like, an eclipse partially in 2017, am I correct? Is that, mm -hmm. 2017. Is that, is that correct, 2017? No, the path of totality kind of changes every time that we have the eclipse move through. So this is very monumental for our okay. area, as right. a matter of fact, because our next eclipse is not going to be for another 20 years. Wow. So we won't have another eclipse wow. until 2044. And the path of totality, full totality, is a little different each time. So if you want to have the full experience in Ida Belt, you need to get here today. Yeah, yeah the next time we'll get a full one in, our, in this part of the country is 2317. I don't think I'm going to be around for that yeah. one. I might <laughs> so come back. Sorry. I'll, 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 I'll be back. With the right smoothies and salads, you know, I think we can make this work, actually. Yeah. Work. We're going to make the most of today. That's right. We're going to count our blessings and be grateful we're here today. And if you come on out. Fantastic. Mm. Still plenty of time for you to head on out to Ida Bell, Oklahoma. As a matter of fact, we're going to take a look at the star once again. The star of the show, the skies, the sun, everything happening in Ida Bell, Oklahoma, all revolving around this big guy. And we are excited to see what the skies do when we come back with more KSLA News 12.